Hello, hope you're all well. It's that time of year again where we're going to unbox my hibernating tortoise, Herman, who's been hibernating for three and a half months. And we're going to get him up and see how he is. And I'll do my best to try and explain some frequently asked questions and stuff like that. Okay. Okay, this is Herman's fridge where he hibernates. Um, a lot of people have a lot of questions about this right off the bat. And the first one is usually, why a fridge? and it's all to do with temperature. So if I was to hibernate Herman outside, it temperature's a bit kind of unreliable. So if it gets too cold, he might freeze and die. And if it gets too warm, he might wake up early. So you really want your tortoise to be hibernating between about four and five degrees. So I try and keep a track of it here. So 3.8, not bad. And then it goes up and down during the night, which is fine. So if we open it up, this is Herman's little box. I've put bottles of water in here which help stabilise the temperature. So what I'll do is, I'll take the little thermometer out and I'll take his box out and see how he's doing. See if I can do it with one hand. Okay. So here's our little panel, and what we'll do is, we'll bring him out his box, and then leave him for a bit. Just leave him to kind of get warmed up, and get, um, get acclimatized to the temperature. As you can see, he's still quite snoozy. So I'm trying to think of any other questions I usually get about this kind of thing. Um, a lot of people ask, do tortoises have to hibernate? And it's really, it's really up to the owner. Um, my vet's always said that tortoises who hibernate, it gives them, um, it's really good for their immune system and things like that. It's really good that they, that their organs and stuff get a rest. And yeah, I always thought, well, Herman hibernates in the wild, so I like to try and keep it as close to that as I can. Oh, he's moving about a bit. What's also quite interesting is before he goes into hibernation, he has to fast for a month just to clean out his system. So once he's once he's awake, he hasn't eaten for three, four months. One of his eyes is starting to open. So he's starting to look quite alert now. So what we'll do is we'll run him a little bath and that'll help warm him up a little bit. Sound good? So I've given Herman a little bath in my sink. It's just fairly kind of lukewarm water, nothing too hot. I don't want to give him a shot or anything. I've put in some of this stuff, Repto uh, Boosts, which helps kind of um, put in some electrolytes and stuff into the water, which will help, help him get some of his energy back. And hopefully he might take a little drink as well. Fun fact as well, tortoises can drink from their, from their butt. Yeah. So I'll leave him in there for a good while, just to get a nice good soak. 
Okay, you have fun, bud. Right, Prince Herman had his little bath, and he's all dried off, so now he's back under his lamps and his little house. So this is a heat lamp that he's got, and then this is a UV strip, which is very important for tortoises and reptiles. So that's him. I'll wait for another year.